started our first mining farm in Bosnia when mining was pure GPU mining and we quickly after that expanded to China where we had our first script miners and after that we went to Iceland where we built our first mining farm. We have now several mining farms here in Iceland and uh, we are constantly expanding further to other countries. When we got here, we found out that it's actually perfect conditions for running a Bitcoin mine. The energy is plentiful here, it's geothermal based, which is a renewal resource, so it doesn't end. Uh, the climate is cold, which means that you don't have to do anything about cooling in terms of air condition and so on. Um, the internet connection is super fast here. And I have to say, we're finding here a really, really open community of people. Icelandic people are, I have to say, really interested in new technology and very open to what we are doing. I think for us, this is the perfect condition. Working inside a Bitcoin mine is absolutely terrible. You're constantly surrounded by machines that are completely shouting at you all the time is like as if you were listening to jets starting and landing without stopping. You can't do much about it. Uh, you are surrounded by a lot of heat. If you're in the hot aisle, it gets about 40 to 50 degrees Celsius. If you have to go over to the cold aisle to maintain the devices, it gets really, really cold. Your fingers start to freeze if you don't have gloves. If you have gloves, you can't use your mouse anymore. But then on the other side, if you have a nerd part of yourself and if you like this kind of technology, it's very fulfilling. I love to be there and spend my time there because I still find the technology fascinating and I can't help myself, but I, I think it's just a great place to be, even though the conditions are not good for, let's say, making holidays. In the last years, we built a lot of mining farms and uh, from my experience, we found that being well prepared is actually key to being successful in it. When we go here, we make sure that we arrive really early. We have a large team of people. Everybody is assigned. Everybody knows what they are doing. We have electricians. We have specialists uh, for internet connectivity that work remotely. We make sure that the cooling is in place and uh, we just have to do a lot of different tasks beforehand. When the miners finally arrive, the whole team is super excited and we are all just waiting for that moment. We put the miners in the shelves, we do our final shelf assignment and when that is done, we actually have time to celebrate. When we built our first mining farm, it was very difficult to manage all these miners. It's a huge amount of devices and I actually had a little script that I used to have just a little list of devices to see what was going on. But uh, soon after that I found that this is not sufficient for our needs. We cannot afford to have any miners not mining for us. And uh, so we looked at the market, we didn't find anything that was sufficient for us. So we built our own product, it's called Genesis Hive and it uh, does basically everything for us. It gives us all the information about the miners that we need, like temperatures, hash rates. We can remotely manage the miners not only in this farm but on any farm that we are working in at the same time. And it takes a lot of work from us by even automatically recovering devices when they are not up and running. And in case that some miners are not working right and they need physical attention, we have maintenance people who are on site and standby and they can always access the miners. They use Hive to easily detect where a miner is located that need physical attention and uh, for example they power cycle a miner or take them out for repair. Having this product is what actually enables us to expand our operation further and uh, we really use it all the time. Uh, we've also offered this now as a product for other users and uh, it's been a very, very big success so far.
I just want to say that I think that Bitcoin is an amazing technology. It has the potential to change our everyday lives. And for me personally, it's a blessing to be part of this. I'm very thankful every day and I love the job.